Duxiga boarding ke ya malala ha e amano amano boarding and day school Good morning Bridges welcome welcome once again to our English lesson I hope you are doing well back at home this is our fifth lesson and our topic for today we are going to talk about is grammar and today we are going to learn the plural of words ending with letter y we are learning words ending with how do we write the plural of words ending with letter y and what does the word plural means the word plural means one and many when you're given one thing when there are many how do you write the plural of that thing for example i have this is the puppy the puppy the baby for dog we say one puppy one puppy when there are many we say like how many do we have here we have three puppies we have one two three so when there are many we say three puppies one puppy three puppies we have more example i have one baby when it's one we say one baby when there are many we say how many babies do we have here we have two babies so we say two babies one baby two babies now how do we how do we write this how, what helps us to write the, the plural of that word we say the word baby and the uh, the word puppy and baby have y at the end if you check very well you find that we have y at the end we have the for puppy for baby and for puppy they all have y at the end so for us to write the plural of this word what do we do we have to replace y with i e s we have to cut letter y and replace it with y i e s for example puppy we have the word puppy So what do we do? We have to remove this letter Y and now we write or replace it with I E S. So it's puppy becomes when there are many now we say puppies. You remove letter Y, copy the remaining letters, and you write you had at the hand you had I E S. We have the word baby baby. The word baby. The word baby is ending with letter why the word baby is uh, the word baby is waiting so what do you do to write the plural of this word we have to remove letter y then you replace it with how we copy the remaining letter that is baby then i e s so for the baby becomes babies puppy puppies so if our letter or if a word ends with letter y what do you do to write the plural of it we replace we cut letter y and replace it with i e s we have more example here i have We have more example here. I have uh, we have baby babies, uh, puppy puppies, baby babies, lorry lorries. The word lorry is ending with letter y, so you have to remove that y and replace it with i e s. We have the word lady. Cut letter y, then you replace with i e s. So for us to write the plural of words ending with the letter y, we have say we do away with the letter y, and then i e s that's how we write the plural of these words now we have other words that ends with letter y but we don't do away the letter y le le for example i have i have one key one key it's only one now when there are many we say you see here there are so many so we say many keys now if you check letter for key the last one key is ending with the letter y but now when we come to write the plural of it we don't cut we don't remove letter y we only had s i have one 
boy the boy the word boy is ending with the letter y so when it's one is one boy when there are many like we have one two we say two boys so it's one boy two boys one key two many keys now why are we not adding why are you not removing letter y and replacing it with the ies we say the word boy and key are ending with letter y they are all ending with letter y to write the plural of these words we only had s you only had letter s at it that is key is keys only adding s we are not doing away with letter y we have the word boy what how do you write the plural of it we only had s at the end boy boys why are we only adding s and h for the for the others like baby we are doing away with letter why the baby is babies yeah if you check we are doing away with letter y and replacing it with i e s why are we not doing it the same with this one reason because if you find the second last letter is a vowel remember very well we have five vowels so if you find very well we have the second last uh, second le letter being a vowel we only had s you don't have you don't remove letter y you only had s for the word boy the second last letter there it's a vowel so what do you do at, uh, to write the plural you only had s so to write the plural of this word you only had s because the second last letter is a vowel don't forget you have five a a e o and a so if you see the second last letter is a vowel you what do you do only had s Now, let's write the plural of this word. We have the first one. We have the word monkey. Write the plural of the word monkey. How, what are you going to check first? Take the second last letter. Is it a vowel? Yes. So how do you write the plural? You only had S. So monkey. Monkey becomes monkey. We only had S. because of the vowel there we have number two we have lorry are we going to write the plural of that word the the word lorry we do with letter y then we uh, we replace it with i e s we have key remember we have said if the second last letter is a vowel we what we do we only had s so we have key Key, we only had s becomes keys cherry there's no vowel so do with letter y so becomes cherries story we have the word story the word story is ending with the letter y what do we do remove letter y then you co replace it with i e s so story stories party parties cut letter y parties then we have country do it with letter y then you replace it with i e s so that's how we write the plural of words ending with letter y always remember if the second last letter is a vowel we only had s and if there is no vowel you have to do it with letter y then you replace it with hi E S That's the lesson for today. Thank you for listening.